Do you ever feel like, man, there's just so many things going on and you're just constantly getting interrupted in everything that you do? In this video, I'm gonna talk about an exercise that you can do to make sure that you can have more time to get things done and move forward faster. Stay tuned. What's up guys, Travis Brady, the coach's coach, branding mentor. So over the years, I've worked with so many people in so many different aspects of their life. Where I first started was actually fitness coaching. And what I've really identified when I started to work with clients is not that they didn't know what to do, not that they didn't know what to eat, is that they kept getting interrupted. So I'd meet with a guy, yeah, I was gonna go to the gym, but this, but that, my kids, and then this, and then work, and so all these different things. And so it kept interrupting the king in his castle. And so what happens is that we don't identify like what can interrupt us and what can't interrupt us in our life with certain aspects. And so when we don't set these rules consciously, subconsciously our programming goes in okay because our subconscious is our unawareness so we're not aware of what we're doing so that subconscious pattern kicks in and then we just start allowing things to interrupt our life especially if we're trying to do something new like working out okay so this exercise is called the king's castle and at the king's castle we have our guards called can and can't Okay, and these are your guards, okay? And you have to give them rules on who can interrupt the king. Because no peasants can interrupt the king off the streets. You must have a good reason to interrupt the king. However, if you're not giving these guys rules, okay, which that's the reason why people get interrupted so much in life. If you don't give these guys rules, they fall asleep and then people start interrupting your workout. Okay, your work, your date night, or whatever it might be. Okay, so you need to start to set some rules. Okay, so what are those rules? So I was working with this guy, I said, okay, what can interrupt your workout? And he goes, oh, when the kids are having an ER, so when there's an ER problem, an emergency, okay, that's a good reason. Okay, one else can be interrupted workout. Oh, when I'm super sick, if I'm go to the gym and it would actually hurt me and I'd feel worse leaving the gym than starting, then that would be another reason that um, I can interrupt what can interrupt workout. Okay, is when it's super sick. Okay, so I want you to identify this and it can be with the gym, it can be with work, right? And it can be with uh, maybe, you know, a certain relationship or hanging out with friends, whatever it might be, okay? And I would challenge you to do it in all those different aspects, say, so we did the can, now what can't? So I identified, well, whams if you just don't feel good, okay? And so he's like, no, not even if I don't feel good. Okay, so that can't interrupt my workout. And so when we're identifying the can'ts, it's what are the common excuses that are happening right now? What are the common excuses that you're using right now that keep getting, I was like, what if you got only two hours of sleep, okay? And he says, no, it doesn't matter, okay? So it doesn't matter if it's sleep, okay? So what are your rules? What can interrupt the workout? And then what are the excuses that you keep using internally that just can't okay this can't interrupt what i'm doing this can't interrupt my work this can't interrupt what i'm doing in my relationship and then what i would challenge you to do is talk about the common people who are breaking down your walls so i love my wife minky however she just loves being around me she loves talking to me so i had to set up rules of when she can <laughs> talk to me during the day and when she can't talk to me during the day, okay? And saying, okay, at this time you can, at this time you can't, okay? And it's regards of this, you can, and the regards of that, you can't. And so these are your rules, they're no born else's, but make sure that you're not just identifying, but make sure you're talking about it with people around you so they can understand your boundaries of certain things in your life, okay? Hope this works for you, okay? Drop your comments below, all right? Be inspired, guys, be next gen. Again, the world needs you, I have spoken.